History lives here, in the buildings, along the streets, throughout the neighborhoods, in the businesses, and in the very heart and soul of every person lucky enough to call Dallas home. The history of the city on the Trinity is a centuries-long tale forged by everyone, from fearless pioneers to outlaws and innovators, cowboys and Indians, artists and entertainers, never quits and ne'er do wells. Deep in the heart of Texas lies a unique story, one with an untamed spirit that is big and bold and boasts a swagger that can't be denied. Nowhere is Dallas history more alive than at the iconic Hall of State, located in Fair Park and longtime home of the Dallas Historical Society. For almost 100 years, the Society has been the preeminent source for collection, preservation, and exhibition of Dallas and Texas history. Each year, thousands of guests visit the Hall of State on a mission to learn about the past, understand the present, and envision the future of Dallas. Visitors learn firsthand the story of Santa Ana's silver spurs left behind on the battlefield of San Jacinto and later engraved on the orders of Sam Houston. They visit the West Texas Room to understand the artistry of the state's most famous ranch brands and turn the corner to see the pocket watch worn by Colonel James Fannin, removed just minutes before his execution at Goliad. And each year on June 19th, the Society showcases General Order Number 3, the only original document announcing the end of slavery in the United States. With more than three million archives, artifacts, manuscripts, photographs, and objects, the Dallas Historical Society is a respected resource for inquiry and study. Authors, academics, and a host of researchers and genealogists call, email, and visit the Society in person or online to access the vast collections with the help of a team of experienced archivists. The G.B. Dealey Library has played host to authors, scholars, and students of history, including Stephen King, Governor Ann Richards, and Ambassador K. Bailey Hutchinson. Through these collections, the Dallas Historical Society creates unique exhibits, showcasing the rich and diverse personality of the Lone Star State from big music to Texas innovation and an exploration of our shared border. The Hall of State welcomes history fans of all generations, serving more than 15,000 students in classrooms and at the Hall of State with mostly free programming. These programs offer unique and exciting opportunities to experience Dallas' rich history through tours, performances, events, and exhibitions. The Society offers history fans a series of carefully curated programs that bring the story of Dallas to life. Notable guests, book signings, historical city tours, and lectures with authors and academics inspire thoughtful conversation while exploring the threads that connect the city across generations and geography. Through the Brown Bag Lecture Series and Pour Yourself Into History Happy Hours, guests take a deep dive into the stories of Dallas at some of the city's most historically significant sites. These events offer insights into the early days of flight at Love Field, the architectural inspiration of the Stonely Court Hotel, and the famous performers who took the stage at the Longhorn Ballroom. Through its many programs, exhibitions, tours, events, and archives, the Dallas Historical Society showcases the legends and legacy of Dallas providing a vibrant resource for understanding the importance and the relevance of history today. Hi, I'm Carl Chow, Executive Director of the Dallas Historical Society. In 2019, construction started on the renovation of the Hall of State. In this renovation process, we not only cleaned up the exterior of the building, but we also renovated this North and the South Texas rooms, which had been closed for the last 10 years. In February of 2021, there was a freeze that hit the city of Dallas and that caused $3 million worth of damage on the building that we had just renovated. Thanks to the city, we have now spent another $3 million to renovate the offices and the auditorium. So now when you come out to the Hall of State, the building is completely redone to its glory of 1936. In the last few years, we picked up a lot of new collections, including the collection of Coach Tom Landry, 
and his wife, Felicia. We have everything from his childhood at Mission, Texas, his playing days with the New York Giants, and we also have all his stuff when he coached in post-retirement for the Dallas Cowboys. So what you see behind me is the diorama of the Battle of the Alamo. It is the largest one ever made. It's 24 feet by 14 feet, and it will be calling the South Texas Room at the Hall of State its permanent home. In addition, photographer Ron San Angelo gave us his collection of photography. He was a photographer for the Dallas Cowboys and the Catholic Diocese of Dallas. Your support for the Dallas Historical Society is crucial. Whether it's financial contribution, donating an item of historical significance, or coming out to one of our events. So I'd like to invite you out to the Hall of State to learn more about the Dallas Historical Society and learn more about Texas history.